Like I said, if you mind, you mind. Robert, if I'm going to be talked to and treated like the way I'm being treated, I might as well have a penis in my life, don't you think? Yeah. That's what you want to do, take a lot of this shit? You know, no, I'll, 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 I'll need to take one. I'll, I'll go ahead and tell you what I've been doing. Ah. That he FaceTimes girls. They send him new pictures. He's, new pictures? Yes. He sends new pictures. I just like I love talking to women. It's happened before where he's saying the same thing he's saying now, and he does it again. How do I trust you if you continue to lie? Is it true? Are you a compulsive liar? Yeah. You are. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah. Plus, he cheated on me with my hip. You're and yeah. Man, no, it wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't like that, man. Actually, actually, we had a threesome. I love her, man. You know, I'm, yeah, I can I love see the love. And, yeah. and oh, you can see the love. Yeah. Why are you sitting well, against each that's other? That's pretty condescending. She said it was okay for the threesome, so I figured it was okay after that. You know what I'm saying? And then, and then the problem arrived. Baby, what? I love you. Listen, man. And all this don't mean nothing to me. Right now. Welcome. Friendships are hard enough to hold on to, but what happens when your girlfriend tells you what to wear, calls you more than 30 times a day, and suspects you're cheating with some of your male friends? That's what my next guest is dealing with and much more. Please welcome Stacy to the show. So, Stacy, you look beautiful. What, um, what's going on? Why are you here? Me and my girlfriend. I don't trust her. She doesn't trust me. I mean, she accuses me of, of sleeping with dogs, cats. Um, oh, him, you, probably. I mean, everybody. It doesn't matter. That's what she does. So, so she's controlling? She doesn't trust you? Possessive. She rolls over before she washes her face and calls my phone, blows me up 60 times a day. Who does that? Where do they do that? So how long have you, how long have you been in a relationship with Q? Off and on, 10 years. We were separated for, for three, three or four years. Okay. Got, just got back together four months. Why does she believe you're cheating? What I kind of do what I want to do. I, I do. Okay. I do, I do what I want to do when I want to So wanna what does do. that mean? Hey... But sometimes Q doesn't come home for weeks at a time. Sometimes she'll stay gone for like two weeks. She pays all my bills. So, you know, I, I don't say anything about it. She'll just stay gone, with, do whatever she wants to do. That's how Q is. If I talk to her about it, she doesn't want to listen. But, oh, I can't. She works a lot. She's never at home. Doesn't have time for me, but doesn't want me to chill with my male friends. I'm going to do what I want to do, Robert. That's just Even though I, she's paying your bills? I don't give a damn what. Do you work? I, sometimes. And what do you do? I do sales. Okay. So she's accusing you of cheating with men and women or just your male friends? She's accusing me of cheating with men and women. Really a particular friend of mine. Okay. We go to the movies. We Are you go attracted to him? <laughs> okay. And that, that, so you're bisexual? Y'all need to be quiet. Are I you bisexual? You. Huh? Are you bisexual? Am I bisexual? Yes. Yeah. Sometimes, depending on what day it is. Okay. Okay. So, would if if you're going through this now with Q and you and you like this male person, why are you still with Q? I love Q. Oh, okay. I want to be with Q. Okay. Q just needs to stop being accusatory. See, if okay. you keep accusing somebody all the time, what does that mean? They're they're doing something. That doesn't make any sense for you to all. She's never caught me cheating. Let me say that. She's not. I've caught her cheating. Okay. I've caught her cheating. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So. So so there must be some other issues in your relationship to get to this uh, untrusting point we are. I stay out sometimes. Like I said, I do what I want to do, Robert and audience. I do what I want to do. I stay out sometimes. So. Does she control what you wear? Did she pick this? No. She didn't right. did, 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 did she control what clothes you wear on a daily basis? So she tries. Yes, okay. she does. And she calls, she's very possessive. Very, very possessive. You know, and she, she calls you 30 times a day, plus, 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 to see to what you do and who you with. Nothing. Breathe on the phone. She don't talk about nothing. Okay. She don't be talking about nothing. It's just to breathe on the phone and, and to listen to my background. Okay. So she doesn't trust you, so she's checking out where you are. You got reconnected four months ago, although you've been on and off for a long time. She just needs to get a... She need to get her stuff together. 
Well. If she thinks I'm cheating, I think she's cheating. We're here. That's why we're here. Okay. We've heard your side. Let's bring out Q. Q, come out here. No, I'm sitting. Excuse me. How are you? All oh, right, how you doing? So, so Q, what, what's going on with this relationship? So you think she's cheating? I... Uh, oh, my, 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 by the way, we're on, in the airport. She's flirting with every single female down the thing. Oh, she, we were walking. She sees somebody wearing, a lady wearing an apron. Yeah, so what, what like makes you think she's uh, cheating? Yeah, come on, she man. She had whenever I'm, I got the free time that she Sir, ma'am. Sir, ma'am. She wanted to sit Sir, up there and, you know what I'm saying, deny me, but Sir, don't answer the phone, reply with a text. Sir, ma'am. Then when she come back for with it, guess who, she, guess who so she's with? She's with... Who am I with? Not me. Okay, so... <laughs> she's a liar. <laughs> she's a... She's a liar. She's a Liar. Wow. So do you feel, do you, let me so ask you. So why you didn't want to come on the show initially? Did you know she didn't want to come on the show initially? Okay. She didn't want to come on why? the show initially. Why, tell you, tell why you didn't want to come on the show initially. Good, I, you feel me? I, why you asking me questions like that? Who is I that? Really is that somebody that you didn't like mold that. in the audience? You didn't put a mold in the audience? But I, you got a mold in the audience. So, so, are you, which one, which one of y'all said that? Cool. Are you insecure? Hell no. Oh, so why, no, so sir. if you're not insecure, if you're not insecure, why do you call a phone multiple times a day, 30, 40, 50, whatever? Same and reason why she always hounding me. And? She's a liar. She's why, a liar. Are you, are you jealous of her relationship with a male? Are you afraid no, of losing it to a man? No, it's not the point of being jealous of a relationship, being with a, a homeboy, a male, or whatever. You fraud, it's dog. You a fraud. Nah, ain't no fraud you stay gone what, weeks what? at a time. Okay. You don't know. Who said that? You got an audience full of haters. If they, if, in, a, in a lesbian relationship, if you I'm said it to me for time, well, yeah, but I said, well, when you with me, you are. You know what I'm saying? So why would I be comfortable and cool with her hanging out with her homeboy all day, every Robert, day? Robert, if I'm going to be talked to and treated like the way I'm being treated, I might as well have a penis in my life, don't you think? Yeah! I would don't say you think I, I might as well be with a dude? I would say it's your personal choice. You really clowning, right? right? I mean, you obviously you, you like men. You act like a dude. Like you, 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 you too possessive. <laughs> like I can't go nowhere. I can't do nothing. You, you work all the time. What you say? You do you, what you want to do. Did you bring me to, to meet somebody? Are you cheating? It, let me find out somebody's here and y'all just snuck a female up. I'm telling you, it's gonna be a problem. Yeah, you gonna do it? Be cool? Are you be cool? Houston, we have, have a problem. problem. Houston, so, we so have is a there problem. anything going on besides uh, the relationship with a, a friend? I just ain't feeling it. I'm not. He's been there before that. you. He was there before care. you. He's gonna be care. there after you. And I don't care. But that right there. So what's it. that's what it is. You are talking that's about you talking about somebody that's been in my life. And when you be at work, he picks up the slack. Oh, okay. Just, okay. How, 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 okay. So okay. I'm gonna ask that question. You open okay. the door. I'm gonna walk through it. When he picks up the slack, what is that slack? Yo, we do. The, that she don't be. I'm sorry. Excuse me. We do things that she doesn't want to do. She's too busy working. Okay. Well, how Thank many you. hours does a chef work? What um, kind of Robert? excuses? You're yeah. a chef. What kind of? I am. You're, you're a chef. chef. So, you're I, a chef. so I can tell you, as I as a chef, I could work anything from 80 to 100 hours a week. You're not working 24 hours a day. Mm, close on it. <laughs> so are you? Is that what you do? Are you a cook? Yes. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay. I do that plus my own personal on the sideline. Okay. Yeah. So you got sideline hosts. So. Okay. Okay. So you wanted Q, you wanted Stacy to take a lie detector test, right? Yeah. Why? Because I want to know. You want to know what? Is she cheating on you? I mean, I ain't got to really, I ain't got to have right. her do it because she just pretty much put. Stacy, yeah. this is Stacy. Will you do me a favor? Would you exit and take this? Uh, one of my producers will take you really? off. That's what you want me to do? Take a lie detector test. This way, don't need to go. Uh, there you go, that way. You know, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll, yeah. Excuse me? Excuse me. I, I, won't, I don't need to take one. I'll, I'll go ahead and tell you what I've been doing. Ah. Uh, no okay. way, don't need to waste your money or your time. I'll go ahead and tell you what I've been doing. Since, you know, you remember the time we went to the strip club, me and my friend, and I didn't come back? 
until 4 o'clock in the morning and my clothes were a little disheveled, we <laughs> around. Can you, can you, can you say... I'm, I'm sorry. We're right, yeah. Yeah, have some respect. <laughs> okay, so yeah, you had just to like the boy. Yep. Yeah, cool. Disrespectful. So, First of all, I caught you cheating three years ago. I caught found numbers in your phone. Hey. I seen phone numbers from somebody. That was the past. That was in the past. I, we talk about what's right now. So, are you in? Are you in a relationship with this man? <laughs> yes, but I mean, she don't ever be there, Robert. What you want me to? Do? I'm not ugly. I can. Do, oh, oh, you don't never be there. Like, right? What kind of excuses so, that? I work. What Stacey, you're, you're not ugly by any way, shape, or form. My question is, is that the only time you cheated or messed around with this male friend? No, it's been others. Other women. Other women? Yeah. How many? One or two. Each? Male and female? <laughs> Just one, that one guy. Okay. And then a, a Do you want to be in a relationship? With the male, or do you want to be like? She's, with let me you? say this: she's never caught me doing anything. No, I ain't uh -huh. know. She's never you just caught me doing me. nothing. I okay. caught you though. No, but still, so, well, you so, need to clean up your act you and learn how. To, you girl. too sloppy. Well, the fact that she didn't catch you doing anything, but, but you she still did it. Right? it out to her. She oh, wasn't right? like, yeah, that's so, what's Robert, up. she's been doing all. She ask her where she was at. Can you where do me a favor? You? Can you do me a favor? Don't flutter your eyelids when you talk to me. Why you like it? Don't flutter your eyelids. Do you want to be in a relationship? She's trying to get you now, Rob. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. No. You are sexy, though. Thank you. <laughs> so, do you want to be in a relationship or not? I don't what? want to be in a relationship with somebody that treats me like I am property. Okay. That's what I'm saying. If you mind, you mind. What you mean? I am not your property. Like I said, if you mind, you mind. If you dealing with me, you for See, me. That's what that's that's it. That's what well, I'm talking I don't talking think about. so. You think this? You think that Stacey is material? No, nah, but she, if she with Mike, me, she's she with mine. me. No, there's a difference in the relationship, right? Uh, she can be with you, but you don't own her. I don't own my wife. <laughs> I'm in a marriage with my wife. You're in a relationship with Stacey. You cage a bird up. The birds don't want to get get out of the cage. Coming up, penis are on the the confession trail. Do you have anything to confess? I mean, hey, let's be real. You want to be real and keep it 100, then, then, then do it. I keep it 100. <laughs> All right. How long is that? And later, why are you still in a relationship? You're saying you're not cheating anymore. She's saying she's not cheating anymore. But what drove you to cheat on each other in the first place? That was opportunity, bro. You know what I'm saying? Our relationship bigger than just, just that. You know what I'm saying? And that's it was then it was okay for the threesome, so I figured it was okay after that. You know what I'm saying? And then, and then the problem arrived. You won't want to miss it. Relationship, right? Uh, she can be with you, but you don't own her. You cage a bird up, the birds don't want to get get out of the cage. That's you can't. Fine. Well, I think you've already. I think you've already done it. Yeah, you've already done that. Yeah, you just, it's just, it's just an analogy. Like you, you try to, you, you try to cage and control something, then it's gonna be. I'm, a, I'm not gonna want to be there. You treat me like I'm. But you wanted me to come back and try some over. Where again. were you when you were staying gone for two working. weeks? Working. You were gone t two weeks working. Working. So, Q. Penis are on the the confession trail. Do you have anything to confess? Oh. Uh, I, I mean, hey, let's be real. You want to be real and keep it 100, then, then, then do it. I keep it 100, <laughs> all right. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? She's there. You know, like my papa always tells me, keep a spare in your back pocket. I, I got that. So you have a spare in your back pocket? What does yeah, that mean? What does that around. actually mean? You have a, a. I got, I got the same one too, but I mean, you know, you, you know. You still fooling with the yeah, same yeah, girl yeah, I caught you with? <laughs> how long? Uh, how, how long is that? Go to commercial. Yes, how long have you been with this other girl? Go to commercial. You came here. You wanted answers, right? You confessed, right? So is this? Let me ask you, Stacey. Is this relationship done? Are you going to go? Or 
What it, what is? I care about her. I love her. Like I don't want to just, you know what I'm saying? But like, <laughs> really? I asked you. Hold on. What, uh, love, though. That's a strong word. <laughs> that's, that's real strong. Well, obviously, oh, obviously, uh, <laughs> you've both been. All right, we both from hoes. I will. I, you know what I'm saying. So where does this leave the relationship? Is what I want to know. I'm done. I'm done. Okay. I'm completely done. I'm done. So you're not gonna lose any sleep over this. So you brought, I asked you on a plane. I asked you to tell me before we got here. It, yeah, I really would be. Like, She's you're talking. right about that. She's talking to you. All right, but I mean, Thank you, Robert. I don't care about that. She's talking to you. Thank you, Robert. So it, That's what I'm saying. Communication is messed up. I mean... Well, listen. <laughs> You went, you went and cheated too, and she cheated too. I can do what I want to do. But so can she. No, I can do what I want to do. I can do what I want to do. Well, here's what I'm going to say. Here's what I'm going to say. You both deserve each other, <laughs> right? Maybe, maybe, if you want a threesome, you bring in your boyfriend. Hell no. I mean, and if you want, and if you want another threesome, like that, you bring in your girlfriend. Well, we can do that. I like to watch. You well, listen, it. whatever you do, I wish you both the best of luck. Um, you're bad as each other. <laughs> uh, you really are. So you pick and choose who you want to be with, what I'm you want to do. I'm single now. Nope. I am single. I'm definitely single. I'm done with this. So there I'm you done. are. I'm you heard it done. here. Stacey's now single. So, no, Stacey, go real for real it. Real Stay real with real us. We'll be right back. <laughs> Right now, I could care less how she feel about it because she's still messing around with him. Well, she's messing around with him and no one actually sexually act, whatever. But that's the part that makes me not care about how she feels at this moment. I'm done with this situation. I can't necessarily say with women because I love women. You know what I mean? But I'm done with this situation. I'm done with you. Welcome back. This is Jamila. She is madly in love with her boyfriend, but there's just one problem. Her boyfriend lives madly in love with sexting other women. So, Jamila, what kind of things have you called him sexing online? He calls other women baby. One of the most hurtful things that he said is, you're the right kind of woman for me. And it pisses me off because um, I tell him, like, you know, if it's not going to work with us, then just let me go because I'm not going to chase you. I'm not going to beg you to be with me because I was in a relationship for four years going through the same thing. And then his excuse is, well, if you dealt with it for four years, then why can't you just, you know, deal with it for me? And I'm like, no, it's, it's not a mistake if you keep doing it. And, so, you know, because I love him, I try to give him the so best. You, so so you, you found photos? Yes. Um, he FaceTimes girls and he may screenshot the FaceTime that he's doing or they send him nude pictures. He nude sends, pictures? Yes, he sends nude pictures. And I'm just really tired of So the, the, the photos of, of women and parts of the body? Yes. Um, like, they may be in panties and a okay. bra. He sends, like, penis pictures. Wow. He, he sent, you know, regular pictures. Oh, he sends pictures. pictures to them, too? Yes. And you're still with him? Yes, I am. I, I, I've said that I was going to leave so many times, but then he comes back with the, you know, the crying and I'm sorry. So he's a compulsive liar? He is. A, he's a compulsive. He lies about everything. The littlest things. And, he, and he, he says that he wants to have sex with these women or sleep with these women that he, that he yes. talks to on yes. social media? Yes. He says he wants So how did you find out about all the things that are going on? I seen it in his phone. And so <laughs> I believe... Like, my intuition told me that lying. I knew he was lying. He wasn't. It's like, you're just going to give him truth. I'm benefited that you're going to do the right thing. It continued to go on. And he's like, well, you know what? You can have the password to my phone. So I guess he tried to use that reverse psychology. But then it came out later on that it was actually one of his exes before he got with me that he was still talking to. So you had a fight just before the show, right? Yes. It was something you found on his phone? Yes. What was that? It was an email um, fr through one of the websites, like, <laughs> yeah, and um, he sent the email saying that he wants to have sex with one of the girls. They were messaging back and forth. But is I sex good with him? Yeah. Okay. 
Okay. It's 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 good, but it's it's a problem with me because I feel like I have to force it out of him sometimes. Okay. And he puts it on. Um, I got a lot going on. It's a lot on my mind. I'm like, well, I have a lot going on. It's a lot on my mind too. So what do you expect me to do? And if I want to, I call it. <laughs> if if I. <laughs> If, okay. I want, if I want to do that, it's a problem. He'll start an argument with me, and, <laughs> okay. and he, he starts an argument with me, and he's like, I'm disrespectful, and I'm like, how? How, how is it disrespectful? Because that's my job. But if you're telling me you don't want to have sex because you have a lot on your mind, and I want to take care of it myself, why is it a problem? Well, I can't wait to hear his answer. Let's have William. William, come out here. Nice to see you. So this beautiful young lady here, um, and you're in a relationship, right? Yes, yes. So is it true that you're ignoring what she wants uh, in sex because you're sexing other women? Well, not because of the other women. Um, just because I have a lot of things on my mind. I do. That's, that's the truth. And I do want her to understand that it's not her. When you're having sex with someone, you want to be into it. You don't really? want to just... Okay. Be doing and be thinking about everything else. So, so is it true? Are you a compulsive liar? Yeah. You are? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah. You know, um, being with her, I learned a lot about myself. You know, some things I do okay. need to work Like, like what? Um, what have you learned about yourself since you've been with Mila? As far as, like, being with her, I can be myself. You okay. know what I'm saying? I can, you know, laugh, just... So, for years, you've been doing inappropriate things online? Yeah. I have. Asking women to sleep with you, sending pictures... No? The whole nine. And, and why do you do that? To be honest, when we first got together, I was just trying to keep my options open, you know. I don't, tr I don't trust no I don't trust no one. I don't trust no one. You so, know, so you, just, you've never cheated, right? Never. Like, so what do, you, like, what do you call just, exchanging naked pictures on a social media site and of, of yourself to other women? That's what, what is well, that? I, I, it's cheating. It's cheating. But you so, just said that's not cheating. Well, I wouldn't... Just necessarily. Just because it's not, not sex with them? Is that what you're saying? Yeah, that, well, sex is does, does like, she not physically give you enough, is cheating. Does she not fulfill what you need? I wouldn't say she would. She don't. She does. She 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 does everything. How often do you have sex? She pushes it like five times a day. How many? Five times a day. It's not that many, but I do I do try. I do try. Most 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 men would not be complaining about that. I mean, I, it's not really a complaint. It's just, you know, like... But, but, but this is, she's like, I need some attention, and you're like this. <laughs> I don't understand that. It's really maybe once a day, maybe twice, and he wants to start an argument about it, and I'm like, why are you starting this argument? What's the problem with me doing it? It's my body. I'm not going to have sex with anybody else. I'm not texting anybody else. It's my body. I'm not going to have sex with anybody else. I'm not texting anybody else. Have you ever sent any naked pictures to another man? No. So, not so, so not what is it I've about been. your your pictures that you like to send to women? I mean, it was all, it was to be honest, it was always a habit. Uh, it's a hard kind of a hard habit to break because I've I just like I love talking to women. But you've got a beautiful woman here. Yeah, you know, I know, and then that's that's why I'm here because I'm trying to, you know, I'm trying to let her know I'm not I'm not on that 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 level no more. But see, I'm here's the good. problem. He says all of this, and it's happened before where he's saying the same thing he's saying now, and he does it again. So, and then the fact that he lies about everything. How am I supposed to believe you? How do I trust you if you continue to lie? So why are you with him though? Because yeah, I, because I try, I want to try and make it work. I want to make it work. You know, there work. are plenty of guys out there that would adore you. <laughs> right? you don't... Here's the thing. William, if, if you don't want Jamila, all right, because she's right. not enough for you, which apparently you can't keep up with, so she obviously is enough for you, right? right? Then start paying attention to her. Start taking her out, treating her like a woman. You said you love her. Then show her that you love her. You know, if you need something from him, right? If you need sex, then, then you have to supply that. Because if you can't supply sex, she's going to find it somewhere else. Then you are useless. That's not only the sex part, but it's that's the why, That's why I feel on my part. I'm just like, man. 
You know, I don't want to be thinking about nothing else. I want to please. I want to please her. But you're not I tell, pleasing I tell her, her I tell her, yeah, that's how I feel. I feel the same way. Good, because you're not. I feel the same way. That's true. Good. Then what right. are you going to do about it? I'm going to put that's, more effort Most people in. would enjoy that together. It. When was the last time you, you uh, uh, sexted another woman? Uh, probably June 1st. Um, so that was the last said, time you caught. She, what she, was the last time you did it? The last time I did it, the last time was June 1st. Okay. Why are you here if you want to go and do all these things? Do you want Why to save I? the relationship or not? Yeah, I do. I okay. Do. So here's what I'm going to tell you. I don't like losing. Look at me. Take care of her. Mentally stimulating. That's a conversation. Be nice. Stop lying. Stop texting and sexting and everything else and sending yeah. pictures. Number one. Take the phone off him. All right? And be in a relationship. Because if you don't want to be in a relationship, believe me. She has no problem finding somebody to be in a relationship. You on the other hand might. Because if you continue to sex and do all these things, people are not going to trust you. Right. Ever. Right. If, you want, if you want to send naked pictures, send it to her. Yeah. Right? And you do voice of her, right? Yeah. Yeah. Build anticipation. Get excitement in your relationship. On a lot of different levels. Not just a sexual level. Yeah. If you want to be in this relationship, you've got to work at it. And that means everything. You've got to tell him what you want. You've got to listen. You either give it or she will find it somewhere else. Yeah. And if you're willing to do that, work at it, you can have a great relationship. If you don't, split up, move on, find somebody who's going to love you and keep on sexting. We'll be right back. <laughs> After the break, why are you still in a relationship? You're saying you're not cheating anymore. She's saying she's not cheating anymore. But what drove you to cheat on each other in the first place? That was opportunity, bro. You know what I'm saying? Our relationship bigger than just just that. You know what I'm saying? And it, and that's it just was what dead. It... Like she said, it was okay for the threesome, so I figured it was okay after that. You know what I'm saying? And then and then the problem arrived. In relationships, when infidelity happens, it's usually one person in a relationship that cheats. But what if both people are serial cheaters? Whoa. Kayla says she apologized to her boyfriend Reese for cheating on him for revenge after he cheated on her. Now he thinks that she's cheating on him again. Kayla and Reese are here today to take lie detector test to save their relationship. Yeah. Welcome, Kayla, to the show. So, Kayla. When did Reese start accusing you of cheating? Um, well, he's accused me of pretty much our whole relationship, but it got serious about two, three months ago. And how long have you been in this relationship? Four years. Four years. And he thinks you're sleeping with your co-workers? Anybody and everybody. So are you? No, I haven't. Not since the last time I told him about. When was that? Um, beginning of last year. Okay. So did Reese uh, do something extreme to ensure that you weren't cheating on him? Yeah, he like, got mad and decided to like, kind of... Yeah. yeah. So why are you with him? Because it's just it's like he wanted to know why I wasn't having sex with him. It wasn't like he was... I mean, regardless, it's disrespectful, yeah. But it wasn't that... Disrespectful? Yeah. That's abuse. Yeah, you call it what you want to call it. Right. Yeah. I'm flabbergasted that A, you would allow that, and B, you're still with him for that. Yeah. Oh. Well, I mean, I've done my dirt to him. He's done his to me. He, he does what I do. I do it back to him. So. so wow. Yeah. So, how, so, so times have changed in relationships, as I think. So uh, how did this relationship start? Facebook. He met me on, he wrote me a message on Facebook, and then we've been together ever since. So you've been together four years. How many times have you cheated on each other? I've cheated on him probably, like, at least six times. And what about, <laughs> and what about him? How many times have you cheated on you? Um, when we first got together, it was like a double, like, he was like a living a double life. He was with somebody else, and then he cheated on me with my hip and Your yeah. Why, why, why would, why would you be with him if you've cheated on him six times, he's cheated on you multiple other times? Why are you together? Because, I mean, seriously. I mean, I mean, we've cheated. We both did our idea. I mean, when he got with me, I was 18. So, I mean, it's only so much you can really expect from a teenager. Like, when I was 18. 
don't care what y'all say. He asked me, not y'all. All right. So, um, so pretty much it's too much you can expect. When he got with me, I was the side bitch when we got together. So I had to let it be known that's who I wanted to be with. Like, so what, what have you done to make this relationship work? I'm here, Anna. I'm just here trying to get past it. Like, trying to get past what? Just anything. I just want him to know why that you, not, Why are you here? Because, like, I want our relationship to work. Like, I'm not cheating on him anymore. When I said I was done, I was done. Like, when he said he was done, apparently he said he was done. Like, I haven't cheated on him almost a year now. I mean, for me cheating every other month or whatever, that means now I'm not doing it anymore. All right, I can't wait to meet Reese. Reese, coming out here. Okay. So, Reese, uh, welcome to the show. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? So, so, you cheated uh, with. Man, no, it, wasn't, it, wasn't, it wasn't like that, man. Actually, actually, we had a threesome. You know what I'm saying? And, and, after, she went, and after she went to work, and after she went to work, you know, I, I kind of, you know, did what I did with. She wasn't there. So, you know. So why why are we here? If if she cheated on you, you know, like every month, every other month, whatever, you cheated on her, and and what what you've been together four years, why don't you just split up and go and find somebody or just have sex with everybody you want to have sex with? I'm asking him. Oh, okay. oh I mean I, I love her, man. You know yeah, I, I can I see the love. And, yeah. and oh, you can see the love. Yeah. Why are you sitting well, together? That's, that's, each that's other? pretty condescending. It is because I don't see your body language sitting next to each other. We, oh, no, nah, because I'm, I'm, I'm just mad about the things that she's saying out here, you know. Um, okay, what, what don't, why are you mad? She, Tell me why you're mad. She's just talking down on me. I don't, I don't really like when people talk down on me like that, you know. Okay, so... But, she, um... Why is she talking down on you? Asked, what, what was the question that you asked me? Well, let, let me find out why you think she's talking down to you. Just the lies, man. Okay, you know, so lies. what is she lying about? Um, what, what happened she lied about? Since she's been up here. I don't know. I'm, I'm just asking you. You've been I'm, I'm asking you, so I mean, tell me. So you, you, came, you came here, right? I, mean, I, didn't, I didn't bring you here. You came here for answers or... We, we came in for a lot of take the test. All this, all this other stuff is just um, extra, extra. So, so what's extra? I don't understand what's extra about it. Come on, man. So, so what's extra yeah, about it? See, huh? What's extra about it? What you mean? What's extra, man? I mean, everything extra, bro. I just, I just want the test results, but I want to prove to her that I'm done with the other girl that I was seeing when I was with her. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I want to prove to her okay. that, you know. And so when, when I turn on the TV screen, believe me or not, right? You know, that's that's up to her. But these lie detector tests is gonna prove to her that I'm not cheating on her okay. no more. That I want to be a bigger man and do the right thing. You know. Yeah. Okay. So, so she gonna have to put some respect on my name after this. You okay. Me? So, so this is this is a talk show, and we're trying to figure out if somebody turns on the TV and say, and me stand there and says, and the lie detector results are this, they don't know anything. So, when I ask you questions, it's to set a story up so that people understand why we're sitting on the stage talking about each other. Yeah. Right. It's not because hey, nobody up. wants to nobody wants my to fault, my fault. ridicule you or her. She said she cheated every other month. You cheated with <laughs> that's a story that now I have to figure out, okay, why are you still in the relationship? You're saying you're not cheating anymore. She's saying she's not cheating anymore. But what drove you to cheat on each other in the first place? That was opportunity, bro. You know what I'm saying? Our relationship bigger than just just that. You know what I'm saying? And, it, and that's it just was what dead. It, like she said it was okay for the threesome, so I figured it was okay after that. You know what I'm saying? And then, and then the problem arises. You know, was that okay? Was that okay? I mean, obviously not, because she says it, well, it obviously is not okay. But I mean, I did give him. I mean, if I gave him the red flag to do it, and then I go to work, I mean, I think you deserve each other. Like, I mean, it's not even I, that I, serious. I think you deserve each other. Still to come. If you stop cheating, you stop cheating, you talk to each other, you both say you stop cheating. Why do you need a lie detector? Okay, because the same reason the next person needed one. They want to know for sure. Like, I'm, I'm trying mean, to prove to her, bro. I'm trying to prove to her that I'm past lying. Let's go read the next one. Read the next one. Okay. I'm not going to waste any more time. You know why? Because you just want the results. Well, I give you no, the results, you can go home. the story. You're just saying that, okay, well, y'all cheated. Y'all deserve each other. Yeah, we cheated, but that's the thing we're trying to let you know. We're not cheating no more. We want to be together. Why do we... Why, if, you, if you stop cheating, you stop cheating, you talk to each other, you both say you stop cheating, 
Why do you need a lie okay, detector because test? Because the same reason the next person needed one. They want to know for sure. Like, I'm, I'm trying to prove to her, bro. I'm trying to prove to her that I'm fast lying. So, so there's obviously something more going on in the relationship than just cheating because obviously that's not it's normal. Obviously, trust issues. That's not normal, right? It's not even cheating anymore. Like, if I'm not cheating at my test, I should pass. He's not cheating. They're trying to figure out for sure. Like, let's move it on. Let's keep it going. So, like, so today happens. I give you a lie detector test that says that up until your point, whatever you came here, you didn't cheat. When you go home, what happens then? We move on and there shouldn't be no more accusations. If we pass, I mean... Okay. Oh, let's do it. Stand up. I mean, let's go. I'm about to say my mind. I'm about to say my mind, baby. Let's get it. Face each other. Face each other. What's up? They want us to fight. Do Kayla first. It doesn't matter to me either way for you guys. Hey. I'm doing it. We asked Kayla, did you have sexual contact, oral sex, or sexual intercourse with another man in your home? The night Reese accused you of wearing different color underwear. You said no. Lighty Sector says, said that was the truth. This one. Uh, but, we're, but we didn't even know about that because you didn't want to talk. So we asked Kayla when Reese when Reese says you came home late. Are you late because you're having sexual contact, oral sex, or sexual intercourse with another man? You said no. Lie detector determined that was the truth. But again, nobody knows that, right? It doesn't matter. We it doesn't. We, know we asked Kayla, aside from the times you admitted, did you have sexual contact with anyone other than Reese that he doesn't know about? You said no. Lie detector determined that was a lie. Oh! Okay. That's cool. Read, it. Read the next one. Read the next one. Okay. Oh, good. That's sexual contact, man. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody put that <laughs> though. Next question. We good. Come on, man. I'm we ain't, here. We ain't breaking up, man. This I'm, strong I'm right here. We that, love man. each other. So why are we doing that? If I'm not I'm laying in bed with that, somebody, that's all, man. You want to know I'm if I'm laying in bed with my you somebody know what I'm else. Saying? Like, I'm... But what does that mean? Like, it means that, it, what it means. Like, but, well, what does that mean? We ask her, aside from the times you, you admitted, did you have sexual contact with any other than Reese? But the thing but, about it is, we, like, it's not even But that. he doesn't know about it. But, okay, he obviously knows about it. So we don't need this. Let's finish it. Come on, Robert. We don't, but, but we, we, if you're not... He, he is right. It do say a size to admit it. But keep reading. Just keep reading. Just keep reading. Wow. Let's get it. Yeah, this is going to be a marriage made in heaven. Uh, we asked Kayla, aside from the times you admitted, did you have oral sex with anyone other than Reese that he doesn't know about? You said no, that was the truth. <laughs> we asked Kayla, aside from the times you admitted, did you have sex in the course with anyone other than Reese that he doesn't know about? You said no, that was the truth. <laughs> we asked Reese, did you have sex in the course with a woman you and Kayla had a threesome with? Without Kayla present, you said yes. That was the truth. That's a confession. I mean, that was the truth, though, right? It was the truth, but you didn't know about it. That. Wait, what did you just say to me? So we basically admitted to having sex. With the... Doesn't matter, right? With you. Doesn't matter. All right, let's move on. Uh, we asked Reese, did you perform or receive oral sex with a stripper at a party that attend you attended recently? You said no. That was the truth. We asked Reese, have you ever had sexual contact, oral sex, or sexual intercourse with one of Kayla's neighbors that she doesn't know about? You said no. Lie detector determined that was the truth. But again, but again we have no clue about what this is because You're we right. didn't talk about it. We asked Reese, aside from the times you admitted, uh, did you have sexual contact, oral sex, or sexual intercourse with anyone other than Kayla that she doesn't know about? I said Reese no. said no. Light detector determined that was the truth. Let's get so, it. So, I wish you both the best of luck and happiness. Thank you. All right? You know, he's being honest with you because he told you everything he did. You both cheated. You both deserve each other. Yep. We both deserve each other, but guess what? You also ain't said y'all both still ain't cheating. Neither one of us is cheating right now. Yeah, that's well, he lied saying. to you. He, li he lied to you. So, um, hey, hey, what you want to do? You, you, anyway. you didn't want, you didn't want me to ask questions. You asked me go directly to the anyway, test. Uh, I went to the test. That's what you got. Can I, can I, can I say something for you? Yeah, of course. Can you kick me off the stage? <laughs> I'm not kicking you off, baby. What? I love you. Listen, man. And all this don't mean nothing to me. Will you marry me? 
Yeah. All right, boom. It's, it's, it's your left hand. The ring fan. There, there you go. You know what I'm saying? I love you, girl. What's all the matter? Stay with us. We'll be right back. You're welcome. Have a good life.